Hello ladies and gentlemen, Ecology here and welcome to World of Warships and today's April Fools for World of Warships is these. It's a toy ship. Well, it's not really a toy ship. Hello there. What is this? Hi. Oh, okay, he's gone. It's basically... Oh, he's back. Hello. He's checking out the anti-aircraft gun. And the binoculars. It's basically his ship. If you ever watched um, um, World of Warships anime series, this is his ship, basically. Oh, he's back again. So he's commanding the helm of his ship. So basically, it's his ship. This is um, based off the um, ship he drives in the series of World of Warships videos. And it's not just that. As you can see, there's this one as well. This one is a... Don't understand that flag, but whatever. Basically the same thing, but different colors. Wait, did he go in a different place? Was he up there? I think he was up there. I'm so confused. And then there's a German one, I think. The Das Boot. Which is white and black. Which I kind of like this. White, black. Yeah, he is up there. Interesting. Hi. Yeah, I'm going to go battling soon. Don't worry, sir. I like it. Uh, interesting flags, actually. I kind of like that. So what is the challenge? Is there any challenges with this? Nope, this one. Alright, so what do I get? In one battle, cause 10,000 HP of damage to ships. Complete in missions of random battles or co-op. The DOS boat. And then same thing with the the other two. And what do I get out of it? Um, flags and credits. Is it the same? Nope. Smoke generator, flags and credits. What are you? Uh, Hydra acoustic sound 2 in credits with flags. Why don't you come with any? Oh, okay. Engine boost. In one battle, cause 1,000 damage to ships. Complete the mission in random battles. Interesting. And then you get repair parties. Okay. That's durable. I can take that. So let's actually get started. There's also this one, set 50 ships on fire, get the mission, what do you get from that? Eh, that's actually pretty good actually. So let's get started. I wonder how many different anima animations he does after a while sitting. I don't know. Let's get started in the German Das Boot. Get started in this. So this thing's a cruiser and it's also a toy ship S type thing. I'm excited. So this is the first battle I'm playing. I have not tested this game mode out at all. So as you can see with the um missions, I, it had no percentage. So, so yeah. Ooh. Ha 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 ha. Kind of interesting that there's a lot of B's and then P's and Is that the American? What's this one? That's the American one. So there is four. I just missed one. Oopsie. Oopsie. Oopsie poopsie. So I'm in a bathroom. This is interesting. So I'm in a bathtub, which looks more like a sink, but I guess it's big enough to be a bathtub. And I'm sailing around with these. I don't know why they have anti-aircraft guns. Like, I don't think there's any aircraft. So it's kind of pointless to have anti-aircraft guns. But I guess it's to make the appearance of his ship. So, But you got floating things like a bottle of shampoo, it looks like. Ducks, a submarine. What is that? I'm so confused. Oh, I have torpedoes. What? Where's my torpedo launchers? In the front? I'm so confused. Where are the torpedo launchers? Is, are, are those the torpedo launchers? I'm so confused. Maybe if I press 3, that would help. 
That's... Oh. So confused. Like, are they in the bow? Are they bow-launched torpedo launchers? That would be interesting. Interesting. I don't know what's the best type of shell for this game mode. Whee! Oh. I wonder if each of these have different... Oh no, I forget torpedoes. I wonder if each have their own different thing. Like, I see a smoke screen. Maybe the Americans get smoke screens. Um, the Germans get the sound equipment, I guess. I don't understand where the torpedoes come out of. It's difficult to tell. Hate smoke. One thing I don't like about World of Warships is the smoke screen. Look, a submarine that we can't play. This is awesome. Oh no, I'm gonna get hit by a torpedo. I'm gonna get Ow. My hit points. Oh wow, these are inaccurate. Speed up, please. I does not feel like I'm doing much damage. I'm going to switch to armor piercing. I, I need to test the waters, so to speak. Ouch. Oh, that's not doing much either. That's interesting. But he is at a weird angle, so... No! Sail away. Okay. I don't understand smoke screens. Like, why do they get smoke screens and I do not? Get out of me, please. Yeah, no torpedoes, please. Ow. Come on, front tra traverse. I need your expertise. Yay, I got one. Enemy torque cruiser. I wish the um captain was on board. That'd be awesome. But since World of Warships has a no people process or no people um on ship type thing. Where, 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 where? I can't zoom out. Oh, I'm on fire. Oh no, my team's not doing well. That's one thing I'm not a fan of World of Warships. Is if your team starts to lose, it's it's 99% you're gonna lose. I'm not a fan of that. I, I think armor piercing is the way to go. Cyrus, my second Kuza. Dar. That's pretty fun, actually. Granted, all it is is just World of Warships with a toy boat thing. It's quite fun. There she blows. And a smoke screen, too. Ba doop! Aww. She got killed. Eh, I, I take it back. Maybe it's not always a loss. Because we just won, so to say. I got two kills. I don't know, this is actually quite fun and relaxing. Like it, it's I like when games don't take things seriously. But I like games that try to do something different. Like I like this game mode because it is silly ships. Like what if this was a real game? How many player how many people would play this if it was a real game? I would. I would love to play this. I need that turret, please. Thank you. I need to sail away. I don't have much hit points left. Cause this is silly, and I like that. Like I like no games have silly game modes. But this is a triple A title, so it's supposed to have some silliness to it. I'm gonna die, and I don't want to. Oh yeah, I'm getting behind the beach ball. But there's a smoke screen. I'm not... 
Maybe I should have been doing that all the time, because that's what that's supposed to do, right? It's supposed to negate the smoke screen. I don't know. Is it possible to Citadel? That'd be interesting to know. I like the sound effects too. I like the way the guns sound when you fire them. They sound toyish. Everything about this sound toyish, and I like that. Shoots from distance. I don't have much hit points left either. I need to capture A. Hello. Why don't you use my torps? Oh, Nemo. Nemo's in my way. That's awesome, though. I get cover. Covering. Can I shoot over wargaming.net? Uh, I'm going to make a turn. I don't want to deal with him. Bubbles. Bloobles. I love boobles. Ugh. They're teaming up. I don't like that. They're teamwork. Oh, hit the beach ball. They're kicking. They're doing their work. Like, they're kicking back. Like, they don't want to, but as long as we capture all these um, positions, we should be fine. Where is he sailing? That direction. Oh, his friend died. Let's see if we can sink this ship. No way, his friend didn't die. Oh, no. Turn around. Run away. Ouch. Yeah, he's gone. Let's see if I can't dodge this shelling. Oh no, I'm getting hit by that guy. Oh no. Hi. Oh no, not my guns again. Dodge. Aw. Oh. Doesn't matter, we won anyways. It's a victory. My toy stern is gone. It's floundered. Rawr. I don't know, it's fun. It's interesting. It's unique. But we've won. No credits, no experience, no nothing, but I got some missions completed, so maybe I actually did get stuff. Ah! I didn't know the missions actually worked with this game mode. That's actually cool. Um, yeah, I, I think Armored Piercing is the way to go. 11,000 damage. You know, I was the third worst on the team. Well, experience-wise, no, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I'm only the third worst. But that's because name is ecology, I guess. Uh, but I did sink three ships, which is fantastic. So, back to port. It's quite fun, actually. So, that was the DOS boat. So, there is an American one? And so there is. And so there is. Interesting. It is American, but it's still a Russian. It has Russian guns, Russian secondaries, and anti-aircraft guns, which is interesting. So let's go down the list. Let's let's go let's go try this one. This one's the Japanese-themed cruiser. Okay, that's why it's a circle. I was confused there, but that that's where you tell. This one's the Japanese one. So let's get going. Let's start going. All right. Hopefully the match will start soon, cause it's not bad. The poke poke boat poke boat poke boat. I wonder what specialities this this um guy will have. Cause the German had the enhanced sonar. So what would this ship have? This has the battleship repair ability. Ah, so the J Japanese can repair its health. Interesting. I wonder if this has submerged torpedo tubes. That'd be interesting. Because I don't see torpedo tubes on there. I, I, I wonder if this is the first ship with submerged torpedo tubes. That'd be interesting. Interesting all itself. So battleship repair ability. That's, that's awesome awesome. I want a circular bathtub. 
I like that he has a wargaming.net towel. Ah, lols. But he has pictures of himself and his goldfish. Or flounder, whatever it is called. That's a small bathroom, actually. Bubbles! Ha! Huh. Does it have smoke? It does have smoke. Awesome. See, this is one thing that I always wanted in, like, real life, was, like, boats in my bathtub when I was a child. Because that's all I wanted. I was like, I want toys. But, no, I don't get toys when I was a child. So that was upsetting. No, I want armor piercing, please. Switch me to armor piercing. I wonder if all this is just a, um... A Japanese tier one, or not the Japanese, um, uh, based off like underneath the um exterior, it's just a Japanese um, tier one or the Russian tier one because it's not clearly not the uh, American tier one, um, based off of. I don't know. I like it though. I think it's interesting. So this has torpedoes. Is it a longer range? See, I don't see any torpedo tubes, though. Unless the main batteries is also, like, torpedo tubes. I, I doubt that. I really doubt that. But here they come. There's some DOS boats. Or DOS boots. I don't want to be by myself. I'm going to turn. Uh, I'm being by myself, and I, I'm not a big fan of that. I gotta go around the well. Gotta go around the well. Bloop. So the Americans get smoke screens. The, Ger the G Germans get a enhanced um, s um, sonar, so you can see into the smoke screens. Shush! I'm not hitting any whale. Yeah, it looks like armor piercing just does the job. If I can actually nail shots. Nope, I'm gonna hit the whale now. Fudgy. Well, I can hit this dude. Oh, no. There we go. It's another poke boat. He has the battleship of parability. Nope. I'm hitting the whale. Hit him though. With one shell. I, don't know, I find this incredibly interesting. Which one do I like more? World of Tanks or World of Warships? Um, Out of creativity, World of Warships wins the creativity. Out of fun wise, World of, World of Tanks is more fun because it's actually, a, in my opinion, a game mode. World of Warships is just World of Warships but with a pretty little skin on it, I guess. Hello. So, that's all I think. Like, I like World of Warships. I think it looks beautiful. It's well done. But, the thing I complain about is it's just basically World of Warships, but in toy mode. Which isn't a bad thing. Come on. Sinker. There we go. First kill. But my team's not doing too well. Not doing too well. I like that this ship has battleship repairabilities. He's going to dump torpedoes. He's going to be a nub. But I want to hit that one because he's broadside. Broadside is much healthy. Citadels. I don't even know if you can citadel. That'd be awesome if you can. Oh, we have an AFK here. That sucks. I think it's AFK. If not, eh, I don't know. I don't know what to say. Oh, you're turning broadside. 
Ha 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 ha. You can easily hit your weak side armor. Maybe. I say I can hit your weak side armor and then not hit at all. Oh, I love the game mode. Oh, wow, okay. Hit him hard, please. I need a good hit. I need a good salvo. Okay, I was being a dumb. I thought it was going to repair a lot of your health. I didn't understand that I was only going to repair, like, very little at a time. I'm so upset now. In a way. But my team's garbage. I, I don't like garbage teams. Of course, I'm all by myself here, so I have no support whatsoever. Come on, I need a citadel. Where's the citadels? I need something to massively cripple this thing. Where's my torps? Oh, that's funny. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Shoot my guns. Oh my gosh. I missed. There we go. At least now I'm far away from the action where they're not paying attention, so now I can repair my ship. As I spam the button. Spam it! Spam it with all I can! I love it. I think it's hilarious. I'm sorry, sir, but you had a guy. Give me more health! I am bleeding, I need more health. Wow, it's amazing how you can turn the tides in this game so easily. Like, I thought, oh, my team's going to lose because they're losers, and then we're winning. But we still need to get into the cap circle to start capturing. Because they have three cap points, and we have none, which is garbage. So if we don't kill this last boat, we're going to be in a world of trouble. This feels so cheaty, like I'm just repairing my health over and over and over again. It's hilarious. But that's the perk of a German ship, is the repeated health regain-ish. Oh no, can I not repair my health anymore? Oh no! That sucks. I, I'm not a fan no more. There's a limitation. No. Well, they win. They captured the zones. All they have, all he has to do is basically run away. Oh, okay. Well, I'm not going to show you the other two ships. I, I'll, I'll give you a preview of what they have, so what you expect. But it's basically the same gameplay. Nothing else. Nothing different. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't want to get out of the cap circle yet. I'm out of the cap circle, ain't I? Oh, P wins. <sighs> I say you can turn the game around, but... You can't really. That's interesting. 140 shots. So basically, yeah, this is the new game mode, and you can win cool stuff. And I like it. I really do. I think it's unique. I think it's creative. So what does the Russian cruiser get? You can easily see by the module equipment. So it also gets... No, it gets the speed ability, so it gets to go faster. 
Okay, poof. That's interesting. And the Americans get the smokescreen effect. Oops, there we go. Yeah, smokescreen. Interesting. So this is an interesting game mode. I like it. I think it's fun. I think it's creative with the... What are you doing? Are you going to make a... Uh, that's perverted right there. But I kind of like it. I kind of like that World of Warships built something that is not too serious. But like I said, I think it's modeled upon the Tier 1 Russian cruiser. The Oknavoy. Yeah. Yeah, it is. You can clearly see the turret, that, the radar, the smoke. Yeah. 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 Clearly modeled off the Oknavoy. All they just had to do is take the Oknavoy and make it silly. Like, shorten the bow. Make the bridge wider. But everything's still there. You got your anti-aircraft guns. The rear anti-aircraft guns. You still got the torpedo or the depth charge launchers, which you can't use. So, yeah. Interesting. So, that was April Fools in World of Warships. Basically, this fun little bathtub toy, which I like very much. I like when games develop something small and unique. Now, what I wish is, like, World of Warships give the rights for someone to recreate this, so to speak, and make their own game mode. Because I would play that any day. Like, a small phone game. Like, make it into a phone game or something like that. Something fun that's not really serious, I guess. But that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And clicky click the like button and to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in more videos. Before I leave, tell me in the comments section what you think about this World of Warships um, mode. Do you like it? Do you don't like it? Do you think they could have done better? Just give me your feedback. With that being said, see you guys. Bye-bye.